Hello friends, welcome to TechEJ YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to see how we can easily uh, set up a WordPress website on AWS EC2 instance by using the Docker container. So, without wasting time, let's start. So, first of all, we have to log in into our AWS console. So, just search for AWS console and you have to enter your id password to login into your aws account so here i am already logged in so here i have a option for log back in so here this is login in Now here you can search for EC2 or we can directly get a link for EC2. So wait for some moment. Now click on EC2. Here we are going to create a new EC2 instance. Click on launch instance. Now select here. Here uh, now we have to configure security group and we have to add rule here we have to add two rules first one is http and second one is http yes so here i am adding first http s and then we have to add a, another rule which is http Now uh, we can also set up here a storage. Now we can. modify it in this manner now we can click on review and launch so here click on launch now we have to choose an key pair so here I am choosing a, an existing key pair now wp docker and click on i acknowledge and click on launch instances click on view instances copy the public ip before address of our new instance Open your terminal or command prompt if you are using Windows 10. Now we have to use this command, which is basically a SSH command cd downloads semicolon ssh hyphen i and path of your uh, 
pam file and our user name of our Amazon Linux 2 is EC2 user and your public IP address and click enter enter as yes now we, then, we are in our EC2 instance now we have to use some commands so here I have to first uh, make sure our uh, EC2 is up to date so use command sudo m install not sudo m update hyphen y ok it, uh, it is all packaged are up to date so here now we can install sudo m install docker hyphen y click enter now it's installing the docker container image docker basically now we have to enable the docker services so give command sudo system ctl enable docker ok it's created as in system link ok now we have to uh, I started our docker image so give a command sudo system ctl start docker now we have to check our status so check either our docker image is running or not so that's good our docker image is running active and running it's go here and uh, now we have to give the permission ok so here this is the command you can copy paste just from the link in description now just I am pasting this command you can also use this same command now you have to basically run this command sudo docker pull our wordpress so here we are pulling the our wordpress docker image so copy here and we can paste it now it's uh, basically pulling the latest wordpress docker image ok now we have to install ok sorry and now we have to run the pulled uh, docker image so here we are going to one sudo docker run hyphen d hyphen p uh, and uh, this is our docker name now check which our uh, docker wordpress docker image is running on our web server or not so for that go on to your ec2 instance console and copy the public ip v4 address of our ec2 instance and paste it in our browser let's see ok sorry for that copy from here and paste click enter ok i think security rules are uh, blocking my request 
now we have to i think uh, update our security rules so go here and edit click on edit inbound rule click on add rule and now add file http okay set here 0 0 0.0.0, 0, 0 slash 0 CIDR and click on save rules now let's try to connect one more time press ctrl r ok go here and copy one more time the word public ip address paste the public IP address here sometime it can take uh, 30 to 60 second time but it's saying too long to respond but then after it automatically loaded ok so click on continue now here we can see we are successfully installed the wordpress now we can add here site title like package username is yes or of 9261 and here we can also add our default password like here i am entering a password ok and we can also enter email ok now click on install wordpress ok click on never and simply click on login now we can login by entering our username and password so that's it for this video we are success successfully logging into wp admin now we can uh, you can set up uh, uh, root 53 for custom domains thanks for this watching this video